Hey, this is Pop Culture Guy. You may notice something different. I decided to do something new with my room to show in my videos. We'll see next time where this lasts. Anyway, on to the subject of today, another unknown spotlight. Today's spotlight will be on Drew Struzan. That name may not sound familiar. And unlike Andrea Romano who works in the films, Drew works after it. Or to be more specific, he makes posters. You may be asking yourself, what's posters have to do with anything? They're just pictures. That may be true, but the way that Drew Struzan does his posters are amazing. No one else does it like him. He has made posters for the Star Wars films, Back to the Future, the DuckTales film, and even if you don't like the film, you are intrigued just by looking at those posters. Posters, like trailers to movies, are basically a small little preview of what's to come. It may not involve sound or any motion, but just the way Drew Struzan does it, they are thought-provoking. I mean, this man is a genius at how he does it. It's not just movie posters. He does album covers, collectibles, and book covers as well. And they're all amazing to look at. They make you want to hear the music, see the movie, read the book. Just looking at these movie posters alone, you can only think of one word. Magic. These posters are just more than pictures. They're his lifestyle. And sure, there are other people who make posters, but those do not compare to what Struzan does. And the posters that are just photographs or screenshots, they are nothing compared to Struzan's work. I believe that more posters in the future should do his style. It is the only way one can do a proper poster while it looking cheap or just lazily done. I and mean, just look at these. They are so filled with awe and imagination. You just you just immediately know what the movie is about. They are filled with magic and awe. And it's sad that because now movies are done really quickly that there's no more time to do posters like his. But there should be. We need these posters. Have them look like what he does. Yes, Trujillo is retired now, but he got out of retirement to do the poster for Star Wars The Force Awakens. The fact that George Lucas absolutely praises the guy and says that all the posters had to be done by him shows how important he is to the film industry. Struzan is the equivalent of a renaissance artist. His work is legendary and it draws a lot of emotions. And that is why people should know more about him. Even if a movie is horrible, even if the movie is hated by so many people, the one thing you can count on is that it had a really good poster by Drew Struzan. And that is a great artist known as Drew Struzan. Thank you. And we'll see how long this lasts.